Hello and welcome to week 94. I'm going to get this over with because I have to do yoga and I don't have great news. Um, <laughs> I am up 0.6 pounds uh, for the week, which means my totals are down 94 4 pounds since surgery and down 117.4 pounds from my highest weight. Um, so yeah, it's been a really mentally challenging week because I've been doing everything pretty good and I'm just like holding on to water and it sucks. So, um, I was actually chatting with, um, someone who has like been on a similar journey and like his name like is totally escaping me right now <laughs> i mean i know his uh, uh god i cannot this is like so embarrassing ethan supley <laughs> he has the american glutton podcast and i was chatting with him in on uh, DMs on Twitter about like how so much of this is mental. Um, but definitely look up his pod podcast. It's called American Glutton. His name is Ethan Suffley. You will definitely recognize him. Maybe not now, but you would recognize his older photos. Um, he was on uh, My Name is Earl. Uh, he was in um, Remember the Titans, I believe. It was that one. One of the like football movies. <laughs> Um, but yeah, you'll definitely recognize him. Um, and he's lost, I think like at least 200 pounds. Um, but he was on a podcast that I did, um, right after, like maybe one or two episodes after me. Um, and I was just like tickled that he happened to watch my episode and, um, followed me. And so I like messaged him the other day just because, like I said, I've, been having like a tough week um and it's just so much of it I think is mental um and getting past it knowing that it's mental because it's like you know at some point I don't know your body just like gets used to it I mean that's one of the reasons why a revision surgery is like the weight loss is so much slower than, um, you know, someone having a weight loss surgery for the first time. Um, yeah. But then also just, I don't know, just getting past that, getting into Wonderland has been very difficult for me. Um, and I don't know what it is. And I think Grace Gastric has been talking a lot about, um, like identity and like her thoughts on weight loss. I'm probably, I'm not the same as her on some of some things, but um, one of the things is definitely thinking about food and eating and all of that, like so much more than before. I mean, like the, um, you know, stereotype is that overweight or obese people are always thinking about food, but um, like now I'm in a place where it's like, I'm always thinking about it versus before, but healthy people generally don't always think about food either. Um, you know, because it's like part of their, their lifestyle. Um, so it's, it's a weird place. Um, she is more eloquent <laughs> on it than I am and probably has thought about her, her views, um, much more than I have certainly before this moment. <laughs> Um, so yeah, I'm going to do yoga because I'm dressed for it. I'm ready for it. Today's going to be a good class. I can tell because it's followed by another class afterwards on meditation and I could use some meditation. All right. That is it. Again, I'm up 0. 0.6 for the week. Um, and, it, and that's the other thing like about like the mental toll that it takes. I'm like, like super, like not depressed, but like annoyed and put down because I'm down or up 0.6 pounds, you know, like that, that affects my mood so much is like what's annoying. 
0.6 pounds. <laughs> All right, that's it. Bye.